In this video, I'm going to be showing and telling you very affordable skincare product that still gets the job done and works for all skin types. So I'm going to be breaking it down, this video down into two parts. The affordable face care product and affordable body care product. It's a wrong mindset that only expensive products work. That's not true. We have very affordable products that still get the job done. So if you're on a budget but you still want to pamper your skin, you still want to take care of your skin, you can consider these products with just little amount of money, you can buy all your products. And when it's time to restock, it's not going to be hard to restock. You restock and your skin will still glow, your skin will still be fine. You go out, people will be asking you, oh, what are you using on your skin? Thinking maybe it's expensive. Welcome to today's video. I'm going to start from body care. So for body care, we have this um, Nivea body wash. This is very affordable and smells very nice. If you're the kind of girly that likes to pamper your skin and get out of the shower smelling nice, then this is for you. It moisturizes the skin and leaves the skin smelling so, so nice. I love the fragrance. Yeah. So it's an anti, it said antioxidants and blueberry scents. You know what antioxidants is now? Um, like vitamin C, they are all antioxidants. So let the fresh shower gel with antioxidant develop, envelop your skin with silky soft foam. Nivea Fresh Power Fruit. Fresh shower for moisturized skin feeling. Let the fresh shower gel with antioxidant envelop your skin with silky soft foam while its vibrant scent of blueberries stimulates your senses. The carry formula pampers your skin, leaving it feeling moisturized. Turn an everyday shower into a moment full of freshness and care. So I like it. It's mild on the skin and it's nice. Then, um... I used Kojisan soap before for the dark spots on my body, but you all know how Kojis Kojisan now is very expensive. So this is what I use for brightening my skin now, the shower. So sometimes I go in with this first. This is not so cheap. In fact, all soaps now are quite pricey. Um, but I go in first with this, then I finish up with this. So I use this too. Some days I might just use only this one because one thing about shower gels is that they don't cleanse your skin thoroughly so you still need to go in with a bath soap so yeah that's how i do i go with this first and then this and then for so for body scrub i use this kuspa this kuspa scrub you all know how scrubs are so expensive now i i love scrubs that of course smell nice this one might not smell so nice but it gets the job done if you're looking for something affordable something on the budget you want to still take care of your skin you can see my skin without spending a lot of money. You see this cool spa, it will get the job done. It will scrub your body very well and it will, it will also brighten. It has to merit, so it also brightens the skin and it will also remove the dead skin cells. It does well and it's so affordable as compared to um, some of these high, expensive, and it's still, this. it does the same thing. Also, it lasts, the quantity is 450 mil. This is 450 mil, so I feel the quantity is good for the price i think this was this was was this how much did i get was this three thousand something or four thousand in naira so there's also another type of kuspa this one there's this one but i prefer this one i prefer although this one i think this one smells very more better yeah this one smells better but i i prefer this one because of the turmeric that is in this one so i prefer this other one and one thing about this um, body scrub is that it foams it foams so even if whenever i'm using this body scrub i just use my body wash i don't need to start doing so much or even if i want to use bath soap i just use bath soap once because it foams very well in fact you can actually use only this body scrub to like maybe any day you're scrubbing you can decide that this is what you're using as your soap after you finish scrubbing you go in with your sponge after you finish using your hand because what i do is i i wet my body then i pour the scrub in my palm then I finish just using my hand to scrub it all over my body. Then I now go in with my glow scrubber. Then once I go in my glow scrubber, even though I've poured out on my body, once I go in my glow scrubber, you see it's foaming and everything. And it's just, once you now rinse your body off, you're already even feeling fresh and clean already without even using soap. That's one thing about this scrub. Body lotion. I use this Nivea body lotion. Oh my God, I love, I'm obsessed with this lotion. It's so good it's it's so nice like it's so moisturizing if you have dry skin or even if you don't have dry and you want something that will moisturize your skin and leave it glowing and this lotion this lotion and nivea also has this other um body lotion this other body one now is mostly for brightening this one also this one also has b3 which is also niacinamide which can also brighten your skin but this one has 90 
95 pure vitamin c so this one would brighten better if you're looking for brightening than this if you just want something that will moisturize your skin very well then this so that's it for body care you can see that these two together i got this i got this for four thousand how much four thousand i'm not sure the exact but four thousand something and this one is five thousand i think three hundred for this one so yeah very affordable body care then let's go into um the face care for me i love to keep my skincare routine very simple so that i don't get tired because once i inculcate too many things into my skincare routine i find out that i'm no longer consistent because it's just so stressful doing my skincare which is supposed to be a form of self-care now becomes stressful and it becomes a chore so i like to keep my skincare routine very simple i just use my face wash i don't even use a toner i use a serum and then i use my face cream then if i'm stepping out i use sunscreen i don't use sunscreen in the house so for face care i use this simple um face wash you know simple has so many face wash they have um different types i'm going to leave it on the screen but for me i love this one i love this one. you know i used to use this face wash before and i was feeling like that it wasn't doing much that's what i used to think so i stopped but then um i said i have a rough skin and i was like okay let me just get the products i used to use before and i got this and in a very short while my skin smoothened and i was like that's when i realized that this face wash actually smoothens my face whenever i use it whenever my um, my skin is feeling rough i'm not talking about serious acne but whenever my skin is feeling rough and i use that face wash it smoothens my skin and just makes my skin feel so soft and smooth so i love that face wash and it's it's very affordable i think now due to the increase in prices i think it's now about six thousand or five thousand something this face wash so once i'm done using my face wash i use this twice to double cleanse i just i wash and i wash again then i go in with my serum so i have three serums here this is the one i majorly use this is a 99 percent vitamin c by um fruit of wakali this vitamin c serum i love it so much i'm not really seeing so much about this vitamin c serum i think it's it's not hyped enough i think it's it's not it's not it's on the hype that how did you put it like it's so nice it has hyaluronic acid it has vitamin c and it has marigold and it's so moisturizing once you put it on your skin you feel the pump once you put it on your skin it's almost finished in fact i've been this is it it's so can you see it's kind of it's like it's kind of um what's the word it's, it's slimy a bit it gives it's giving off slim mousine <laughs> it's slimy a bit and i love it it's so moisturizing on the skin and just a little can go a long way on your face this one so this is the serum i mostly use then for exfoliating i use this serum how much did i buy it? but it wasn't it wasn't expensive it wasn't expensive as compared to all these high-end um vitamin c serums and they said it's 99 percent vitamin c that's what they said so far it's been good on my skin i've been using it for months and it's good on my skin then i use the ordinary this one is not affordable affordable but you need a um chemical exfoliant for me i don't advise that you use scrubs body scrubs on your face and not even body scrub i don't advise that you use physical scrub on your face even if it's a face scrub as long as it's a scrub something that you carry and scrub your face i don't think it's, it's i don't advise you but your choice some people prefer physical scrub but for me i moved i used to use physical scrub on my face and sometimes after scrubbing my face my, my skin will be just tired and using physical scrub can even damage your skin barrier so i use the ordinary lactic acid um i use 10 percent. this is 10 percent. it's lactic acid plus hyaluronic acid i use this like two to three times a week yeah once it's a serum so once i just finish um taking my shower washing my face and i come out you have to when you're using this you, you have to dry your face is vitamin c that you can use on a moisturized face when you want to use this you have to dry your face completely and then i go in with um this leaving it for a few seconds once it just it has completely absorbed into my face then i go in with my then i go in with my face cream this is another very affordable serum this is face fact vitamin c serum this is very affordable and it's a vitamin c it's vitamin c very affordable serum face fact vitamin c serum i think this is about three thousand something this this serum so it's very affordable then after going with my serum like i said i don't use a toner so 
once i'm done with my serum i go in with my face cream these two face creams they are from face facts i've come to love face Facts because face facts face fact products are so good yet so affordable anything face fact is very good yet affordable like their face wash if you don't want to use simple face wash you could try um face fact ceramide face wash it's just like um what's the name so these two are face facts face cream this one is um face fact ceramide it contains is a moisturizing gel cream five ceramides plus hyaluronic acid plus oats like the things inside this face cream is a lot it repairs your skin barrier maybe you are using a product that has damaged your skin barrier or maybe you are not using any product for a while and you want to start this is so mild on the face and so moisturizing any issue you're having on your face and you're using actives you're using harsh products just and you're beginning to notice some reaction redness and all of that you can stop using those products for a while and get this face cream this one see how big it is this is i think five thousand yes this one is five thousand as big as it is like this so it's a very good one compared to the fact that now um, products are very expensive to see a very good face cream now is expensive i'm not sure about the price um, when I'm editing this video, I'm going to check the current prices and I'm going to put them in the video so you can know the updated. But these products are very affordable. This other one, this is face fact also. This one is vitamin C. So you know vitamin C is also, I can call it an active, though it's not a harsh active. So, but it's not every it's not good to always go in every day, every day, every day with vitamin C. That's not good because vitamin C is, like I said, is an active. So it is I don't use my vitamin C, though it's mild though. It's mild on the skin. This I don't use my vitamin C. I use this one. This one was at 3,000, 3,005 or so. 3,005. And it's, it lasted so long. You're seeing it like this. It's big. This is 15 mils. This is... Oh, they are both 15 mils. Just different um, designs. Also, it's not good to um, mix vitamin C with other actives. Because vitamin C, like I said, is an active. So, this is the ordinary lactic acid. It's not good to go in with another active which is vitamin c it can clash it's not good so that's why anytime i'm exfoliating because this is a leave-in serum once you rub it you don't wash it out i now go in with this one because it's mild and it doesn't contain any active everything in this in this product is calming it's calming it has five ceramides hyaluronic acid and oats so that's how i usually pair my face um so it's not every day i use it on a normal day i just wash my face um, apply my serum vitamin c serum and then go in with my <clears throat> vitamin c face cream so this is not recommended but i use this bt plus face cream on any time i don't it's not like something i use steady it's just in my it's just there in my closet anytime i notice my face is getting too dark i bring out this one and i rub it maybe just for two or three days and it brightens my face why i don't use it every time is because i think it has it should have so they didn't write but it might contain hydroquinone i'm not sure but the fact that it's so effective is a very very effective face cream some people that want to brighten up their face like you want to become fair this is the kind of this is what they use but me since i'm not going for that it's only anytime when i notice that my skin is maybe i've been stressed and my skin is getting too dull and dark then i just use this for a few days and i keep it again so they say it reduces pigmentation minimizes dark spots yeah so it's a nice one and it also makes i don't know but this product it makes my face glow so yes guys that's it for the affordable skincare products so please now that things are so the economy is very hard in nigeria i don't know where you are but i think it's a global thing things are more like there's inflation everywhere you can go for lower products that are not so expensive and still get the job done it's a wrong um I used to think like that. So it's a wrong mindset that only expensive products work. That's not true. We have very affordable products that still get the job done. So if you're on a budget, but you still want to pamper your skin, you still want to take care of your skin, you can consider these products I've talked about. With just little amount of money, you can buy all your products. And when it's time to restock, it's not going to be hard to restock. You restock and your skin will still glow. Your skin will still be fine. You go out, people will be asking, yeah, what are you using on your skin? Thinking maybe it's expensive. But very simple. Very. You don't need to do too much for your skin. Sometimes doing too much will even overwhelm your skin and make your skin start having reverse reaction. So please, if you've watched this video to this point, please subscribe and like this video. 
I appreciate you. If you have any questions or any contribution, please drop it in the comment section. Thank you so much. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.